Here's the way D.C. police are telling the story tonight, that it was just after 10 o'clock last night here at 1737th Street Northwest that there was a group of young people standing up on this balcony here on the second floor of this apartment building when a car with dark tinted windows pulled up out here on 7th Street and at least one gunman opened fire, firing a number of rounds, hitting a 14-year-old in the head and grazing a woman. You can still see the remnants of the gunfire. There's a bullet hole in the window here, and there's a bullet hole in the doorway up there. In a tweet last night, D.C. police said investigators were looking for a silver sedan with dark tints and a dark-colored sedan with dark tints and D.C. plates. A law enforcement source familiar with the investigation says detectives are now only looking for one car. The motive is unclear. A closer look shows in addition to the windows being hit by gunfire, other parts of the building were struck as well. Surveillance cameras may have captured the shooting. A number of them are mounted on the balcony where the young teen was hit. So far, police say there is nothing to indicate any of the other recent shootings in this section of the city are related. In the district, Paul Wagner, News 4. So far, that 14-year-old is still in critical condition. As of July 28th of this year, D.C. police say 33 people ages 17 and younger have been wounded by gunfire. The